Let's add and subtract decimal numbers. Okay, so we're looking for the box. So first step is to get this over to the other side, we're actually going to add six to both sides. So when we do, when we add six to negative 4.4, it's gonna be like 6.0 minus, so that's gonna cancel out, minus 4.4. which will give us 1.6. So the answer is 1.6. Okay, how about this? So we're gonna do 9.8 plus 2.7. It's gonna give us a five here, carry over the one. That's going to give us 12.5. Okay, now here's one where we're going to subtract 5.1 from both sides. Now, adding two negative numbers is like adding them and then putting a negative. So we'll just take the 9.5 and the 5.1 and just add them get a 6 and a 14 but it's going to be negative so it's going to be negative 14.6 okay now we're going to subtract 9.6 from both sides and when we have a big, so we have a negative and a positive, right? So we can actually just do 9.6 minus 2.7, and that's the wrong subtraction. So we'll just flip the answer at the end, right? So this will give us a nine, that'll make that an eight. This will give us a 6.9. But we know the answer is gonna be negative 6.9 because 2.7 is smaller than 9.6, right? So when you subtract 9.6, you should get a negative number. So negative 6.9. Okay, same idea. We'll subtract six, we'll subtract six. 1.2, well, let's go ahead and do the subtract six, subtract six. Let's do six minus 1.2, we'll flip the order. We'll get eight, four, and then because we flipped the order, we have to make it negative 4.8. Okay, now we're doing the same sign, negative, negative, so we can just add them, 2.3, 0.3, get 2.6, but then make it negative at the end. So it should be negative 2.6. Negative 2.6. All right, let's add 4.8 to both sides. And that'll be 4.8 minus, and this is actually the right way, because 4.8 is positive, 3.9 is negative. So it'll just be 0.9. So it'll just be 0.9. All right, this is gonna be a fun one. You'll see it'll round out, plus 5.9 plus 5.9. Well, that's nine and that's one, so it'll add up to 10. Those two numbers just add up to 10, but we're gonna write it as 10.0. Okay, how about this? Well, they're the same sign, so we'll do 5.9 plus 5.6. 
And then we'll make it negative at the end. So this will be a 7. This will be a 1 up here. So we've got 11.7. Oops, that's wrong. 5.9, 5.6. That's a 5. That's 11.5, but it's negative 11.5 because it's negative and negative. So a negative 11.5. And here we have 7 and 4. They're both the same sign, 11, but they're both negative, so it's negative 11. Okay, so we just have more chances for error. So we're going to add 43.9 point nine six to both sides. Let's be very careful here. So forty three point nine six plus eight point five nine. Okay, so this is gonna be a five. It's gonna make this Right. I'll just put a one there, whatever, however you like to do it. So it'll be one plus nine is ten, so five again. Put another one here. We get a twelve, and then we get fifty-two. Fifty-five. Okay. That makes sense. Because if this were forty-four, then we get fifty-two, fifty-nine, but then we subtract four. So 52, 55. Okay, better quit while I'm ahead. I'll let you guys practice these, and I'll see you next time.